Hey guys, Rebecca411 and welcome back to my channel. Everybody is on lockdown. We on lockdown down here in Texas. Everybody is self-quarantined and all this and all that. This coronavirus got everybody tripping. But you know what ain't tripping? These protective hairstyles I've been rocking for the past three weeks. Look at that lusciousness. You see all that lusciousness? And that's about two weeks old right there. Yeah, check me out on Instagram. But we're about to do another protective style. And I decided to go in with my um, Soul Tanicals. Yes, this is going to be a very moisturizing twist protective style. Check it out. So, I have some time before I rinse this deep conditioner out by Sotanicals. So, I want to tell you guys about this, okay? Let me catch you up, though. First, I went in and I shampooed with my Biotin Boost by Hass, my thickening shampoo. I'm back on it. I'm back on it. So, I went in. Now, I already have the Shea Bay and Ginger Deep Conditioner. That was like, whoa, that blew my mind right there. So Tanicals, Shea Bay and Ginger was like, whoa. I loved it, okay? So I didn't think it could get any better. I really didn't think it could get any better than that. You know what I'm saying? So I order the Manoa Moisture Slip Deep Conditioning Fertilizer Dip, Protein and Glycerin Free. Baby. Baby, it say leave on for 20 minutes or overnight. So you, I guess you cannot worry about a moisture overload with this. And rinse and style as usual. Well, we leaving this on. I probably got about 10 more minutes before it's 30 minutes because that's how good it felt. Let me let this sit for a few more minutes. Get my little station ready because we're going to be putting up these protective twists and I don't know, I don't, I don't know. This thing blew my mind. I didn't think it could get any better. I didn't think it could get any better than the Shea Bay Ginger. I didn't and this has blown my mind. And these products been around for a while but of course, I've only been on this natural hair journey for a little over a year. And my hair has done a total turnaround. So I'm gonna go in with the knot sauce for a leave-in, and then the Marula Mur Moisture Guru. And I really don't think I need to add an oil to it, but if I do, then it'll be the wild growth hair oil. So that's gonna be the order. That's gonna be the LCO. The leave-in, the Moisture Muro, Guru, Moisture Guru, Muro, mm, yeah, yeah. And then the wild growth oil. Because doing this protective style, I'm doing this to protect my hair since really there's nothing else to do. There's no reason to do a wash and go and you just sit in the house all day. Um, but yeah, let me get a few more minutes of quality time with this and uh, I'll be right back. All right, so I got my little t-shirt on my head. Now let, this is when you know if the deep conditioner really went in or not. It's how your hair feels after you rinse it out. And I rinse it out in cool water because I'm low porosity, so I want my cuticles to kind of close with some of that moisture in there, opposed to just rinsing it out in hot water, which just leaves your strands open and you're really rinsing all of the deep conditioner out. And I need that moisture. So, You see what I'm saying? My, oh yeah, my hair still got the moisture. Feels good. It's definitely moisturized. And it did a little something something with my curls. So, <laughs> so Tanaka! some of this cream 
and this is a silky, silky feeling. I wonder if it's got an aloe vera in it. So at this point, this is when you would detangle. Oh, it just glides right through. And it smells good too. It's got shine all by itself. Mm. And we're gonna take a little of the Moisture Guru. Really put that on my hands first. Add at your own discretion. A little goes a long way. Those curls. The conditioner and these products. Oil. Now, this amount of oil, I'm just really just starting it with this, okay? But I am gonna be oiling my scalp as well. So we are getting ready to put in our first protective style twist. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, two separate parts. I try to make sure that my sections are equal and then I do it tight at the roots and just loosen up as I go down make sure that hair don't come over there check you feel some tugging. And I have to make sure that these are good and coiled at the end so that they will not come down. Okay? That's the whole thing. You do not want them to come down. are not many twists. No, no, no. My head is too big for it. I did it when my head, my hair was shorter. But, and I'll probably do it again. But not at this date and time. I'm about to do, watch me some Netflix. So I got my first two healthy twists in. At this point, you can Go in with your oil on your scalp just in case you want to add some extra oil.
my video. These are my twists, medium size twists, moisturized twists by Soul Tentacles. My hair feels great, my scalp feels great, the shine is amazing. It's just do right. They just did me right, y'all. They did me right. Once again, I used the uh, knot sauce as my leave-in, the, de the core detangler. I went in for the cream and used the Marula Muru Moisture Guru. Say that five times fast if you can. And I sealed it all in and oiled my scalp with the wild growth oil. One thing you need to freshen up your coils is water. You spray a little water, detangle, not detangle, moisten your strands and give your hair a little shake, probably put a little more oil in it, and then bam, you're done. So this is my hairstyle for the next week. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you're new, If you're new, go ahead and subscribe. Click on the notification bell. And if you're already one of my subscribers, thank you guys so much. Keep God first in everything you do, and I do mean everything. And I will see you guys in the next moisturizing video. It may be a protective style, or I am actually, it'll probably be a wash and go, just because not going anywhere. But it'll be a wash and go using this curl juice. This hair mousse by Soul Tanifals. I'm, I'm kind of very interested. And we'll be doing the LCO method on that as well. So I'm really kind of interested in it. All right. See y'all in the next video. Bye.